A toast notification is a message that your app can construct and deliver to your user while they are not currently inside your application. Starting with the version 19.5 of, of Advanced Installer, you have the possibility to display a toast notification when an update is available when the application is launched. If the user chooses the Remind Me Later option, each time the user will launch the application, they will get a notification. In case the user manually closes the notification from the X or interacts with it, they won't see the notification until a new notification is available, a for example, when another update is up online on your website. This is done automatically to avoid spamming the user with notifications. If the user chooses to ignore the notification, each time they will launch the application, the notification will be displayed. If they choose to install the new update, then the updater.exe will be launched as it is configured in the updater view. Those notifications are only displayed when an update is available. If no update is available, there won't be any toast notifications. For all the above functionality, there is no need to write any code. Everything is built in our updater.exe. So, to enable the toast notifications, you need to create the shortcut to the updater.exe instead of your application. Also, a special command line is required so that the updater.exe can launch the application while checking for updates. Basically, while your application was launched, the updater.exe started the process to check for updates. In case an update is available, it will display the toast notification, otherwise it will simply exit. Now here's how the shortcut to the updater.exe looks like. You will need to specify the following command line to the updater.exe slash just check minus restart app and the path to your app. As the installation path use, usually includes spaces, encapsulate them to the path in quotes. The first parameter is used to trigger the check for updates process, while the second one is used to launch the application while the updater.exe is checking in the background for the updates. To better understand how the updater works, we have multiple articles on our website and also videos here on YouTube. This option is useful when you don't want to make any changes to your code base to display the TOS notifications. For those that want a deeper integration with the updater.exe in their application, check the following article that is linked into the description and to see a full list of comments available for the updater.exe. An important note is that any existing project that uses the updater with a small change can take advantage of the new functionality. Just create the shortcut to the updater.exe instead of your app and configure the shortcut properties as described above.